what is up the world it is your friendly neighborhood slip gator here and today we are over at Suzuma's base and I gotta tell you he's been doing a lot of work over here and it's really nice um I really really like it but I feel like one of the things that I've always noticed about him I mean, look at all these chests they're basically empty so he's he's kind of well organized but I feel like um a lot of the items that he has he just has too many items um and I, I feel like it's something that he needs to kind of work on um, is the fact that he's just got a lot of stuff and things over here at his base. Um, and he's it's just a little bit crowded over here. It's just There's just a little bit too much stuff. So what I thought I'd do is just kind of help him out and kind of start to get rid of some of the stuff. Um, you can see I already got rid of kind of his, some of his villagers. Wow, there's a lot of lag. Um, cause I think, see, it's causing frame rate lag. Um, if you look on the screen now, there's 2,262 entities, um, here, and it's just causing a lot of problems on the server. Um, and it, it's really not fair to everybody else to kind of have this much, these, you know, this many items around. So I thought what we'd do is just kind of, TNT is a really good way, if you didn't know this, it's a really great way to kind of get items out of your way. Um, it's something that you can use to really kind of simply, you know, get stuff and things just, you know, cleared out. Um, but yeah, so I just kind of wanted to see, you know, how much lag all this stuff is causing. Um, oh, that TNT didn't even go off. See, that's how, there it goes. That's how laggy it is. All these items just cause lag. Um, and if you look in this top of the screen now, there's 3,000 items. Um, just on the ground. I mean, and I mean, I'm only getting like three FPS and it's just not really good. So I thought we would, we would kind of, like I said, help him out and clear some of the stuff out. And, um, I think it's going to be good because in the long run, really what it's going to do is help server performance. Cause as you can see right now, it's just really, it's just running poorly. I mean, you know, there's 4,000 items on the ground, or maybe six. Now, there's 4,300. 4, I mean, and it, I'm getting, what, like one FPS. So, it's just, you know, we're just going to clean this stuff up for him and kind of help him out. And I think what I'm going to have to do here is we're just going to have to take a little bit of a break. And we're going to have to kind of let these items despawn so that the frame rate can be a little bit better. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna wait a couple minutes here, and uh, I will be right back. So just uh, a little bit more work to do um, around here to kind of get these entities cleaned up. So I thought we would kind of speed things up. Yeah, that looks like it's gonna work a little bit faster. Oh man, see, this is a major problem with frames. It's a major issue on the server. And it's just not, I mean, the server can barely even keep up with the amount of entities that are in the world now. I mean, look at this. 10,000, 5,000. I think some, some of the entities, it's from the TNTs exploding, but I mean, it's just crazy. It's just a crazy amount. So let's go ahead and one of the things we've actually had on the server, I asked the guys to um, go ahead and help out with um, some commands that could help us to clean the clean the server off a little bit. So, oh, yeah. And so, yep, I got a little bit of that going on. Uh, but we've definitely made a big improvement here. There's a couple more chests, some more stuff and things hanging out. Um, this is a big, this is really noisy. So we're just going to get rid of all this stuff because it's just making a really awful racket. Um, so um, I feel like we've really made um, a big change um, and we've really kind of helped out the server. So there's a couple other things around. Oh, I'm in this little trap here. There's a couple. Other, I'll just get out this way. There's a couple other things in the area that I want to take care of um, today. So I'm going to go ahead and get set up to do that um, to kind of. You know, get stuff and things going. Whoop, that was a big jump that I just made. That was crazy. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to work on some different stuff and things. I think that this um, 
Gold Farm needs to get a little bit of fixing going on over there too. So I'm going to head over there and I'll be right back. So just to save on time, I went ahead and um, I did a little bit of hacking work and got the server turned into, uh, got creative mode in the server so I could kind of get rid of some of the stuff a little bit faster. So I figured we'd just tear these down. Um, this, Because this gold farm, I mean, it doesn't really seem to do a lot. Um, and it's definitely a huge eyesore. Um, now, no one really has to deal with the fact that it's an eyesore except for Suzuma. But sometimes, you know, you have to do things for people to help them. You know what I mean? Like, you you know in your heart that you know what's best. Um, even if sometimes other people don't. So you just kind of sometimes have to take it to the next level. And, you know, you have to show people what what is the best thing that they could be doing, you know, at the time. Um, and so I think that, yeah, taking this thing out is going to be pretty helpful. Um, and I wanted to thank... Um, Specifically, uh, Mumbo and DMAC, uh, Hypno and uh, Joe Hills, Zombie Cleo and Biffa, uh, Mumbo, I said Mumbo, uh, Spumwack and Corrales, pretty, pretty much all the other guys on the server, because we talked about this and um, they all kind of were in agreement that this is what we should be doing. Um, so um, I think that's good. You know, and I think definitely one of the things that I've done is it looks better. You know, it's better than it was. I think maybe if we just kind of took some of this stuff out, it's better than it was. Um, yeah, that see, it looks really good. Um, but yeah, there's some other things that I wanted to go kind of work on as well. We're going to head over back over um, down into the bottom of Zuma's base here. Um, and we'll do a little bit of work down here as well. Um, I think that we could... You know, just kind of continue to to um, to help out. Wow, I got a lot of this crappy sand in here. But um, I think that there's a lot more stuff and things that we can do to kind of, you know, spruce this this area up a little bit and just kind of make it look a little bit better. Um, and get some of the stuff. He's got all these things, like, around where it just kind of clogs up the air. You know, the like, the views. And, I mean, I think he's trying to make it look nice. Um, but I just feel like we have, it's just not, you know, so let's go ahead and set some other stuff up so we can get some stuff and things fixed around here a little bit. So another thing that's really, um, kind of obnoxious are a lot of animals, um, and they make just a huge amount of noise. Um, and they're also, you know, kind of, uh, an, they're an eyesore, they're an ear sore, which is something I never knew about until I started playing Minecraft. So, um kind of taking these guys out is really going to be, you know, pretty helpful um, to to stop uh, problems with lag with server resources. Oh, I just leveled up. Problems with lag with server resources um, and those sorts of things. Um, that's pretty helpful. Now, uh, I do know that it took Suzuma a long time to kind of get these animals moved over and get them bred, but I just feel like this is better. Oh, there's a couple extra. There you go. So I just feel like this is better. Um, you know, I just feel like it's better. So we got to kind of get down inside of here. Now, Suzuma also took a, a really long time um, when he was kind of moving all these little guys over from the nether to make this um, this floor, which is a really great design. But again, you know, we can't you can't just do whatever you want willy nilly. You got to think about how those entities, you know, they stack up, they add up. And after a while, they become, you know, a strain. Um, leaves do that too. A lot of times, um, leaves can be um, a kind of a problem um, for certain people when they are um, they're playing on fancy graphics. Um, you know, they can cause different problems with lighting updates, and it can just be kind of uh, you know bad for the bad for different players on the server. So. Um, I think this is a, something just lighting a lot of this on fire to help clear out the leaves would be really, again, just helpful um, for the server so that people don't have to deal with all that lag all the time. Um, it's just going to be a lot easier for them this way. Um, and right, I'll tell you what, right now it looks pretty good. If we stand back here, let's go ahead and hit F1. This, this is a, probably a pretty good screenshot we could take. Yeah, I like that. We've got a screenshot there. 
we might use that for the thumbnail for the video um so but yeah that cleaned out a lot of the leaves here um maybe we can just go ahead and get some of that lit up do we get any any of these upside down stairs to will they fire up oh i'm on fire no i'm okay um yeah some of that stuff's lit up maybe that'll catch down inside of there um but yeah i think that's uh definitely an improvement and it's going to help on server resources as well you know another thing i was thinking about around here is that this base is really this wasteland it's really beautiful and this this central base just kind of it kind of blocks your view of the wasteland so i'm thinking maybe what we need to do is kind of work on yeah yeah that's better see because now it looks more like it's a wasteland you know before it kind of looked like a wasteland with like a nice building in the middle and that's just see this stuff this, this stuff is everywhere all the stuff that just blocks your view and you can't really you know appreciate the emptiness of it all go ahead oh better yeah see this is really good um actually we probably want to leave this portal we'll just get that lit up casey wants to come and see what's going on um but i definitely feel like we've made some improvements um in this area and i'm really glad that you know what i mean i kind of thought about this idea and i got a chance to come and do this i mean basically almost a community project really um is what it is so oh i broke that portal that's unfortunate um there i fix see i fixed it um and i'm just really glad that um you know this is the kind of stuff i like to do on the server um when i did the community build for the ender portal or you know you know just different stuff like that um i think that that sort of stuff is pretty fun um i really like doing it uh and so it's just really good to take time from doing your own personal projects or you know something like that um to just kind of well let me fix that that was kind of rude um to help out the community it's important to be a team player um and so yeah but i think i don't know i think that might be it for today guys um i had a really good time and it it, it took you know i always talk about time it took it took a lot of time to kind of clean that area up so um Please let me know if you like the video, you want to support the series, please don't forget to hit the like button. Feel free to share and favorite the video as you see fit. Don't spam it on Reddit. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. April Fools. So for any of you guys that were actually gotten throughout that entire thing, if you actually thought that I would blow up Suzuma's base, you sillies, that is not the case. Um, we just wanted to do an April Fool's prank on you guys, and there's a lot of other great Hermitcraft videos um, from guys who've done other pranks to other people. Uh, so if you haven't already, let me see if I can do this. Oh, I can't. Oh, crap. You, uh, oh, here we are. Very personal. This is very cozy. If you haven't already, go ahead and check out some of the other guys' videos. Suzuma Void to put a retaliation video up. There's a link to that video in the down there. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of great stuff that went on from the Hermits today, and I'm really excited to see all the videos. Um, but yeah, so before you mash the hate button, just, <laughs> just so you know, it was just a joke. So um, yeah, I hope you guys liked the video. Thanks very much for hitting the like button. I hope you have a great rest of your day. April Fools! Peace out, Wasteland!